I was taught that resting was lazy. Resting was you just not trying hard enough. Nerve wracking just because you want to do the best that you can for yourself and for your coaches and your family and everyone that supported you and then of course for your teammates in your country. Ready to work my butt off and train really hard because my dream was to go to the Olympics. The 20 most dominant and you're number one. People train their whole life for those moments, so just intense things happen. It's it's just very an extreme environment in that building. Yeah. You can feel it. It's crazy. We expect them to uh, always do the personal best every try. I literally can't even express to you how hard it was training. There were days where I would get out of bed and just collapse the floor because my muscles were so tired and I just overworked my body to the point that I literally couldn't go anymore. I think all athletes can agree that you're a different person when you're training. You know, if I went to sleep past 10.30, I would freak out because I didn't want to have a bad workout the next day. You know, I always had to be on a certain schedule. Basically, it consumes your life. I think I could have been shot in the leg and still had that, and I would have definitely been like, no, nope, I'm good, I want to go right now. Them to their death, try to prevent them from dying. <laughs>